What's happening friends? Don here once again with Trotec Laser. Today we've invited the Electrical Engineering Department from Centennial College in Toronto, Ontario for a personal development day. We are showing them demonstrations on the Trotec laser machines, laser safety precautions, applications and material processing. Overall, our goal is to show how laser technology can advance different programs at colleges and universities across Canada. Hi, I'm uh, Robert Wixon. I'm from Centennial College and we've got a professional development day finding out new equipment that we can bring to the students. We had some professors here today actually trying putting out their name tags and, and trying some stuff. So very directly, one of the courses I teach is a capstone course and students need to be able to build things that they haven't been able to do before. We've got 3D printers, but now with lasers we can do much more precise cuts and uh, better builds. Instead of tape with uh, uh, cardboard, now we can use acrylics and hardboards, so it's much more precise. And as we move forward, we want better and better technology for what students may actually see out in, their, in the field. Uh, Lamacoids, electricians use lamacoids all the time to label their equipment. We can do it with lasers. So if students know how to use lasers this way, now they can actually produce their own lamacoids. Maybe a company has one, they'll be trained on it. In the automation department, uh, Industry 4.0 is going to become more and more important. Well, we have lasers here that actually interface into it. We train PLCs for electricians. I've been told here that some of their equipment actually interfaces into PLCs. So I can see many different things that these lasers can be useful for, uh, for training and out in the field. A big thank you to Centennial College for coming for our Laser PD Day at Trotec Canada. If your high school, college, or university would like to register a physical or online PD day with us, please click on the link in the description. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you again next week.